A man accused of murdering his own daughter in New Bedford went before a judge just today. We've been tracking the story for you since July now, and now new at noon, 45-year-old Walter De Silva back in Massachusetts and being held without bail now. Eyewitness News reporter Jared Kleiner working that story in New Bedford. He joins us now live with the latest from the mobile newsroom. Brian, good afternoon. District Attorney Tom Quinn calling the alleged facts here chilling. Now, De Silva, Walter De Silva picked up in Connecticut just last month. If you recall, the 45 year old De Silva, he entered court as we go to video smiling. And the gallery, as you can imagine, did not care for that. He is accused of shooting his 19 year old daughter, Sabrina, to death the day before July the 4th as she unloaded groceries here in New Bedford. Prosecutors say the father and daughter had been estranged. They began to reconnect until a perceived slight. She was supposed to go down and visit him on Father's Day of this year. She chose not to do so. This defendant was very upset with Mr. Silva for that, as well as her dating an older man for which he did not approve. In addition, prosecutors say Walter De Silva confessed to detectives and that he showed them or directed them as to where they could find the firearm. It was in his attic, according to prosecutors. Now, a significant problem here is that Walter De Silva, prosecutors say, tried to kill Sabrina De Silva's mother back in the early 2000s, served an eight to 10 year sentence for it, was then deported to Brazil upon his release, and they say months later, De Silva came back into the United States illegally through Mexico. We'll continue to follow this. We do have new reaction, and we'll have that for you beginning live at 5 o'clock. For now, live in New Bedford, with Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom, I'm Jared Pleiter, Eyewitness News.